friends, welcome back to my channel and a very special welcome if you're new here. My name is Jen, I'm a certified weight loss and nutrition coach and today is meal prep. I have three amazing recipes for you packed with protein, sweet treat, breakfast and lunch. So if you're excited, give this video a big huge thumbs up. Make sure you're subscribed and your bell notification is turned on because I do a meal prep every Monday and I do upload five videos every single week. Check out the description box down below for nutrition coaching where I offer personalized to you macros and calories as well as one-on-one -on -one coaching for accountability and if you would like to chat with me directly. I have been following macros and calories since the beginning of 2022 and have lost over 100 pounds. You'll also find my recipe website where you will find all three of today's recipes, links and discounts to my favorite things, and come join our Facebook group. We'd love to have you. So let me turn you around and let's start meal prep. For breakfast this week, I am making lemon ricotta protein pancakes. This recipe is five ingredients, so fresh and delicious, packed with protein, perfect for the warmer month. So let me show you what's in the recipe. First, you're going to need vanilla protein powder. I'm going to use my Ascent Native Fuel in vanilla bean. This protein powder is great for cooking with. It adds a really good, delicious vanilla flavor. I just buy this right off of Amazon, so I'll make sure that I link it down below for you. You're also going to need some flour, low-fat ricotta cheese, lemon juice. You can also use a fresh lemon for zest, but I'm completely out of lemons. I use them all in my water. So I'm just going to use lemon juice, and then you'll need eggs. So the recipe makes a single serving. I'm going to make three servings since I'm heading out of town on Wednesday. That way I have enough pancakes for the first part of the week. So into a small bowl, we're going to add one quarter cup of low fat ricotta cheese, one egg, a quarter cup of our Ascent Vanilla Protein, a teaspoon of all-purpose flour, and about a tablespoon of lemon juice. And then whisk that all together, and that's your batter for one serving. I'm going to make one big protein pancake. You could do small pancakes, whatever your preference. So I have a small pan warming up over medium heat. Here is what the mixture looks like. I did spray my pan with some nonstick cooking spray. Go ahead and add your pancake batter and then I'm just going to flatten this out into a pancake shape and we're going to allow it to cook through. Go ahead and flip your pancake, allow it to cook on the other side. These look so delicious. I did go ahead and make up another bit of batter and I, like I said, I'm going to make three pancakes total. The lemon ricotta pancakes are done. These look so good. That is a huge, huge pancake. What I'm planning on doing is pairing this with some fruit, maybe some extra protein like a yogurt or cottage cheese, but this is going to give you a good amount of protein. You could top it with syrup, butter. You could even zest some lemon over the top. Maybe some blueberries would be really good, kind of a lemon blueberry vibe, but I am excited to have these for breakfast the first part of the week. I will go ahead and put points, calories, macros here on the screen for you. For my lunches this week, I'm actually making a Cobb salad wrap. Again, going to be super easy to throw together for the few days before I head out of town. So let me show you what you'll need. You're going to need a wrap or tortilla of your choice. I really like the lavash bread. There's fiber, there's protein. So I'm going to do half of a lavash bread per wrap. You'll need hard boiled eggs, deli turkey, some type of low calorie dressing. I have the Bolt House blue cheese chopped romaine, tomatoes, avocado, and some bacon. So to assemble our wrap, we're going to start with one tablespoon of our Bolt House blue cheese dressing. And we're just going to spread that around on the wrap. And then we're going to add three ounces of deli turkey. I'm going to try to keep everything on one side of my wrap so I can fold it over one piece of bacon, one hard boiled egg. I'm going to add a couple tablespoons of chopped up tomatoes, a quarter of an avocado, so I'm going to cut this one in half and then slice out a quarter. And then lastly, some romaine lettuce for some crunch and added veggie. And then I'm just going to take my wrap and fold it over. 
and that dressing will kind of help keep it all together. Slice it in half before eating. And here's what your wrap looks like. Doesn't this look absolutely delicious? I'm actually going to have this for lunch today and I'll show you how I'm going to store all the components and each day I'll quickly just assemble my wrap. That's one great thing about meal prepping is having everything ready to go where it takes just a minute to put together a healthy meal. So here's how I'm storing everything for my wrap. And like I said, it'll be really easy just to throw it together each day. So I already bought my romaine chopped up. Definitely saves time and effort. We can use the leftover chopped romaine for salads. I buy my hard boiled eggs, usually from Costco, pre-pilled, ready to go. You can also hard boil your own and then peel them and have them ready to go for your wrap. Chop up your tomatoes. I have all my leftover avocado in an avocado keeper. It keeps it nice and fresh for several days. I will link it down below. I just bought mine off of Amazon. Pre-cooked bacon, again, super easy. You just warm it up for a couple seconds, get it nice and crispy. So it is ready to go for the week. And then I have my lunch meat in a Ziploc. All I have to do is weigh out my three ounces. So that's just going to make assembling my wraps for lunch super easy. For snack, a sweet treat this week, I'm making cinnamon sugar protein donuts. I've been craving donuts and these sound incredible, so let me show you what you'll need. Again, you'll need a vanilla protein powder. Of course, I'm using my Ascent. Like I said, this one does great for baking and cooking. It will be linked down below right off of Amazon for you. I'm going to be using the Lakanto vanilla cake mix. This is really low calorie. It's 50 calories per serving and a couple grams of protein, low sugar, low net carbs, gluten-free. It is really, really good. I just buy this off of the Lakanto website. I do have a 15% off discount, so I'll link that down below for you. Unsweetened applesauce, I have my Lakanto granulated sweetener, cinnamon, nutmeg, and some eggs. Super easy to make our donuts. I'm adding one cup of that Lakanto cake mix to a medium-sized bowl, two tablespoons of unsweetened applesauce, a dash of cinnamon and a dash of nutmeg. And then one full scoop of a scent vanilla protein powder. Go ahead and stir that together. I do have some water off to the side here. The recipe calls for about seven tablespoons of water. I'm just going to add it in until I get that right consistency for donuts. I went ahead and pulled out my donut pan. I'm going to spray it really well with some nonstick cooking spray. I have a scoop here and I'm going to scoop my batter into the donut pan. It does make six servings or six donuts. Our donuts are going into a 325 degree oven for about 14 to 15 minutes. Donuts are out of the oven. I'm going to let them cool for a couple minutes, pop them out of the donut pan, and then we're going to dust them with cinnamon and sugar. So I pulled the donuts out of the donut pan and I'm just going to dust them with some Lakanto granulated and some cinnamon. I'm going to let them cool, package them up, and I'll be back to share points and calories. So here's the donuts. These look so good. I mean, can we say Dunkin' Donut Shop quality donuts here packed with protein. So I will go ahead and put points, calories, macros here on the screen. One donut is one serving, about a quarter, an eighth of the calories, points, and macros of regular donuts and packed again with protein. Thank you for joining me for this week's meal prep. I hope you are as excited about these three recipes as I am. If you are, give this video a big huge thumbs up. Again, subscribe if you're not because we do a meal prep every Monday and five videos are uploaded on my channel every single week. Don't forget to check out the description box for my recipe website, nutrition coaching, including macros and calories personalized to you, links and discounts to my favorite things, and come join our Facebook group. We'd love to have you. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.